Welcome to Knowledge Base 85. So in this video, um, I'm going to show you how to capture uh, information using a proxy and um, conduct penetration testing or just get some information if you're a hacker. Um, you how to get like valuable information from that um, request from a proxy. So I'm going to be using uh, SQL map, uh, burp suit as my proxy, and um, I mentioned SQL map and basically the uh, Metasploitable tool. So I got my Metasploitable tool here. I've already uh, installed and configured it. Um, so it's in the same subnet mask as my computer, as my Linux machine. So just going to show you real quick. So make sure that they're in the same segment mask. As you can see. So I'm going to go ahead and um, the IP here is 10.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.0.
just doesn't have to go in the plain text. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and um, save this. I'm gonna save it to my text up here. I'm just gonna say that's pen text txt. I'll save it. Okay. And I'll go back to my network settings and then disable the proxy. We use the system proxy. Awesome. So at this moment, I think I'm done with um, that is portable and and proxy. Now I'm dealing with SQL, SQL map. So. There we go. So I am going to conduct a dialog pseudo SQL map and Nazar. So the reason why I'm typing in my Nazar is because I'm getting this information. I'm running a test from a file that is in the root. So if you run it from a URL, you just type in my Nazir and then type in whatever it is. I can't. Alright. So since I'm conducting um, my file is in is in my root, there's no need for me to do that. Okay. Yes. Okay, so now it's gonna run. <coughs> So you see all that information. It's funny. So from here, you can customize your search. You can print out the tables. You can. Um, it is recommended to perform only basic email tests if there is no uh, this one other potential to be found. You want to reduce. I'm going to press, so I'm just going to press my enter, that's the default, for no, okay, it looks like the backend DVMS, uh, so it just showed me here, the backend database is this, all my SQL, you want to skip the payload, and specific, uh, let's just say, yes, we want to skip the database. And then for the main test, you want to include all the test for uh, uh, Just say no. So it's going to run the test, and um, after that, then you can query, and then you can get the tables. You can get the tables of the usernames. If there's credit cards, you can structure the, uh, your, your commands to get that information. So. In this video, my, my intention was to show you how to get to the stage. And when you get to the stage, it's all up to you. Depends on what information you want to extract from that from that database. So um, that's it for this video. So like I said, in the next video, um, I'm gonna sh I'm gonna do the same thing, but this time I will be checking. I'll be using a different tool, which is the W uh, P scan, the WordPress scan. So what I'll be doing is I'll be uh, scanning the websites for any vulnerabilities it's like application level and at, uh, database level. So uh, thank you very much for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe to Knowledge Base A5. And uh, click on the bell so that every time I, I make a video, uh, you will get to know about it. So thank you. Bye.